This deserving family has a new start and the keys to a new home. It's hard not to be emotional at times like this because this means something. This isn't just a dedication of a home. As far as I'm concerned, this is a lighthouse of hope. Orange County Mayor Teresa Jacobs and leaders from Habitat for Humanity presented the Stevens family with the keys to a refurbished home in Pine Hills. No keys. Mayor Jacobs says the county is committed to preserving neighborhoods hardest hit by the struggling economy. You know, neighborhood night by neighborhood, family by family, we build a county, and that's what we're doing here. For this family of two loving parents, five children, moving out of a two-bedroom apartment into a four-bedroom home refurbished is just incredible for the family. Orange County launched the Neighborhood Stabilization Program with the help of $28 million in federal recovery money. The county partnered with Habitat for Humanity to repair and resell homes. We started this partnership with Habitat to help us um, address areas that were hard hit um, f with foreclosures, but also were, were, were tough neighborhoods where you, know, you would have some difficulty in getting financing and mortgages, and Habitat has a program that can help very low income home, home buyers with that financing mechanism. 25% of those funds had to be used for very low income housing and they chose Habitat to help them with that portion of it and so we received $600,000 to go ahead and uh, purchase and rehab homes and turn them over to our homeowners and sell them to our homeowners. The way the program works with us is we buy the homes from lenders that have foreclosed on the homes. We purchase them, we do a budget, submit a budget to uh, Orange County uh, and then uh, when we close on it we start to work. We were fortunate we were able to purchase seven and rehab seven homes with that money. So it's, it's a wonderful opportunity for us to move some of the families that have been in our pipeline for two years into homes. Habitat for Humanity is a nonprofit Christian organization dedicated to providing families the American dream of home ownership. There we, go. we look at the, the amount of work that needs to be done. We look at the families in our pipeline too, where we're trying to choose homes that we can either add a bedroom or something that's larger. And sometimes families have disabilities, and we keep that in mind too. And we just see if it's a good fit for what we're trying to do. This home was built in 1978, and we went inside and we took down all the way all the drywall, all the flooring out, and we rebuilt it from the inside out. It was a three-bedroom home, and we made it into a four-bedroom by closing in a family room. Since 1986, Habitat Orlando and its volunteers have helped over 160 families become homeowners. Families desiring a home can apply for assistance. The families have to have a housing need, whether the house is in disrepair, overcrowded, or unaffordable. Um, they have to be willing to partner with us, which means they have to perform 300 to 500 hours of sweat equity, uh, which is building the home, their own home and, and helping build homes for other families, build or rehabilitate. And then they have to be willing to partner with us on um, classroom time, which means 40 hours of classroom time, 20 of that is on financial literacy. It's all to prepare them for home ownership and help them be a successful homeowner. We give them a mortgage at cost and uh, at zero percent interest. Mayor Jacobs says this dedication is about more than just owning a home. It's the promise of a better future for the Stevens family and the community of Pine Hills. What that's going to do to this, these kids and their future and the pride that they have in their home, it, you can't even measure. But beyond that is what it does for this neighborhood, what it does for Pine Hills, this community cared about them, total strangers lifted them up in prayer, came out and, and put their sweat equity into this. It's way more than a physical structure. It's that idea that somebody cared about them enough to, to help them. It's really been a blessing and for my family and we really are thankful for all the partners and the people who put the time in to give us this opportunity and without them we'll still be out there just trying to make it and it's, it's just a great opportunity and we're very thankful.